Hello, good evening, this is Diecast Loon, I hope you're all doing well. And tonight I thought we'd take a look at some uh, older Matchbox that I picked up on a local for sale site uh, from a collector that wasn't too far away from me who just wanted to get rid of some castings um, because they just have basically too many. So uh, nonetheless, that's what we're going to be taking a look at tonight. So we'll get straight into it in usual fashion and we'll take a look at some of these cooler, older Matchbox. Now these ain't too old, but... Um, they're not, I, th I think they're mainly from 2015, but like I said, we'll take a closer look and we'll, uh, we'll have a look. So anyways, just move the camera in a little bit and push it down slightly. There we go. So the first one I'm going to take a look at is this one, which is pretty cool. So as you can see, it is the 1975 Chevy van and it's got Can't Drive 55 on the side. <clears throat> Excuse me. And it looks like the Grim, the Grim Reaper, possibly. But we'll be able to look a bit clearer once it's at this old and dusty, broken blister pack. But very, very cool anyway. Uh, let's have a look, see if we can see when it was made. So it says 2000, the copyright's 2011. So, like I said, it's not ancient, but it is older. But anyway, let's, uh, let's open it up. <coughs> Excuse me. And there it is. Very, very cool. So this side, you can see it's got like a skull. Very, very cool. And then this side, you can see it's got... Oh, it's a skull with the Grim Reaper all merged into one. By the looks of it, so that's very clever. Yeah, very clever. At least I think it is. Yeah, but anyway, very, very cool. And you can actually see through the windows on this one, which is good. And it's in like a matte black finish. But yeah, very, very cool. And so a quick look underneath. So it says, so it's a 2006 copyright, Mattel, Chevy van. But I do have another variation of this. So I'll just, just put the camera on a little bit more. There we go. And there's the other van. And I do believe this one's slightly older again because this is another old one that I picked up again uh, in its blister. <coughs> Excuse me. And um, I can't remember what the copyright on this was, but I, I know this. I'm sure this is a slightly older casting. Um, but uh, but this this has this has a chrome front and a chrome underneath, which is pretty cool. But it's exactly the same, same copyright, except this one's uh, water and power. But uh, nonetheless, but yeah, very cool to have another version of it, especially with this cool sort of um, almost like airbrush work down the side. But very, very cool anyway. So that's that's that. So we move them to, to the side. And then we've got this express delivery van. And I think it says Elite on the side. And again, I think it's... What's this one? Let's see it. 2015. So this one's a bit newer. We'll try and open it nonetheless. And it is, I'm trying to work out what it is. If it's it's plastic, plastic top. Ah, okay, so it's all plastic. Well anyway, it looks like a plastic top. But it's got a very very good paint job for, it, for being it's plastic but uh it don't matter too much i mean <clears throat> i prefer it when they're all metal but uh that's where we are the back opens up which is pretty cool and you've got obviously got this like almost like a sunshine roof on the van but in real life they would have a fiberglass top to them anyway so it would get a bit of light in it so that's actually quite real quite real to real life but anyway no, nonetheless pretty cool so we've got a metal base and it is in red it just says express delivery and it's uh 2009 copyright i believe but anyway pretty cool so i put it off to one side and then the last one which is uh probably my favorite one it's this 14 Chevy Silverado 1500, so it'd be a 2014, I presume. 
So this will probably be yeah, 2015 copyright. So again, not massively old, but still older casting, slightly older. And still not getting into it. In. Let's put the camera right down for this one. And this one's, like I said, very, very nicely done. It's in like a sparkly, I would say a metallic grey. You can see all the sparkle in it, which is very cool. And it's got these nice sort of chrome looking off-road wheels on it type thing going on. And it's pretty cool because it's got, it's all tampered on the back. So you can see it says Silverado, you've got the gold bow tie. The lights are done. And then on the front, I don't even see that, but it's got some on the plate, which I think was on the box. I'm just going to look at the box if I can see what it says. I think it says Texas, but it does, it is, the plate is tampered in. And the lights are, you can just about see it there, with all the chromes making it hard to see. And again, the, the bow tie is gold. So that's pretty cool. It's it's very, very nicely done. Black bed. And then underneath, if we can see it from the reflection, it says 2014 Chevy Silverado 1500. And that is a 2014 copyright. But great, great little finds. And not all that expensive. I actually paid £4 for all three. Um, which was very, very good. Um, so that was very, very, very good finds. Very happy with them. So anyway, so that's the cars for tonight. Let's just pan back slightly. And move the camera, get in the shot a bit better. There you go. So that's tonight's finds. Um, please stay tuned because I'm hoping possibly Monday, maybe Tuesday, I've got my first Tarmac Works car coming. I ain't going to say what the car is. I'll keep you guessing, but all I'm going to say is I've just um, ordered a Tarmac Works um, limited edition. It's a limited run, um, but it's very, very cool. Um, there's loads of stuff to pick from. I couldn't decide what to order, but I thought I'd go, like I said, I'd go for something a bit, a bit more high end. So I thought I'd go for a Tarmac Works because from other YouTubers I've seen that they, they look really, really nice. So anyway, Stay tuned for that, and possibly at last my restoration should be finished tomorrow, so that should be pretty cool. But anyway, please like and subscribe, and I'll see you all very soon. Thanks for watching.